Ang gabi po sa inyong lahat, nasa inyong harapan, ang napakaganda, ang kamukha ni Era Madrigal. Ako po si Angel at naniniwala sa isang simpleng kasabihan. Hindi lahat ng may magandang mukha ay babae. Malay nyo, ako pala ang dati nyong kumpare. Thank you very much, candidate number one. Candidate number two. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mariko. Mariko sa gabi. Mariko sa umaga. At isa lang po ang kasabihan ng paniniwalaan ko, di man ako kasing ganda ng nanay nyo, o sing sexy ng ate nyo, malay nyo, ako, ang kuya nyo. Thank you very much, candidate number two. Candidate number three. <laughs> Mabuhay. I spent seven years of my life in the States. <laughs> Pero po, nalaman ko na pusong Pinoy parin po pala talaga ako. <laughs> my name is Pitit Brokovic at naniniwala po ko sa kasabihan na binitsawa ni Dr. Jose Rizal na ang taong hindi marunong magbahal sa sariling wika sa call center ng Lipana! <laughs> Candidate number three, and last but not the least, put your hands together for candidate number four, Mysterious Dance. <laughs> Maganda ang gabi po sa inyong lahat. Dumating na sa inyong harapan ang kakaibang Diyosa na kagandahan. <laughs> And I stand six feet below the ground. <laughs> Ito po ang bagong Rosalinda. My name is Carla Abeliana. Naniniwala sa kasabihang pag maaraw at biglang umulan, kinakasalang tikbala. <laughs> Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen, for our four not-so-lovely candidates. We come now to the most exciting part of the pageant, and that is the question and answer portion. Candidate number one, step forward, please. Doon mo na ako, Bess, ha? Sige, go, Bess. You look very intelligent. Thank you so much. Uh, what is your favorite subject? Ever since I was a child, my favorite subject is science. Well, that's very difficult. What's your favorite planet? Ever since I was a child, my favorite planet is Mercury. Mercury, interesting. Why Mercury? Dahil sa Mercury, nakakasigurado po kayong gamot ay laging bago. Thank you very much, candidate number one. Candidate number two. If you were to become an animal, what animal would you like to be? Oh. <laughs> I would like to be an amphibian. Amphibian? Why amphibian? Because an amphibian is an animal who can leave both water and land. Nice answer. Can you give us an example of an amphibian? Oh. A frog. Nice. How about another example? Oh. <laughs> Another frog, thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number two. Put your hands together for the very confident candidate number three. You seem to be the crowd's favorite candidate number three. How are you? I'm hungry. <laughs> I can see that. What for you is the most important part of your body? Sorry? <laughs> <laughs> What 
for you is the most important part of your body? Well, the best part of my body is that my neck. Why your neck? Parang wala ka namang neck. Because my neck holds my head and my head holds my face for I believe that my beautiful face will hold the crown for tonight's competition. Oh! the second most important part of your body second yes <laughs> <laughs> well my second part of my body is that my kidney <laughs> your kidney why your kidney because i believe that kidney is the capital of australia thank you <laughs> okay pa kaya to? the third most important part of your body for you my mouth. Hello? Why your mouth? Because that is the place where I live. Mouth, my own volcano. Thank you. Thank you very much. Candidate number three. Pasensya, may sakit siya. Ladies and gentlemen, candidate number four. Do you want an easy or a difficult question? Um, I am the most intelligent candidate, so I'd like you to throw the most uh, difficult question you can ever think of. Oh, I love that. And excuse me, Mr. Holes. Uh -huh. um, ask me in English, please. Wow. So what is the longest Tagalog word that you know in the dictionary? You don't know? I don't know, that's why I'm asking. The longest Tagalog word which I googled is nagsisipag sinunga sinungalingan. What does that mean? It uh, it means pretending as if telling lies. Now you know. Are you Manny Pacquiao? Next question. Uh, excuse me. Uh huh. Is this a quiz, B? No, you just have to answer. Okay. <laughs> what is the longest English word that you know? You also don't know. I don't know. Um, the longest English word that I know is Numino Ultramicroscopic Silicovolcanoconiosis. What does that mean? It's an inflammation of the lungs caused by the inhalation of silica dust. Nice. Is that all? Next question. What level? Difficult. Oh, my. Aside from your face, <laughs> what is your problem? Well, uh, Mr. Holes, uh -huh. let me tell you this. I don't think I have a problem with my face because I'm used to it. <laughs> it is you asking me that question, therefore I think you are the problem and you are my problem. <laughs>